In the world where each minute matters, business jets are pushing out slower to bow prop planes, which are limited in speed by the annoying laws of physics. However, these good old propeller aircraft truly shine in terms of fuel efficiency and lower operating costs, allowing poorer executives to save up some cash and buy yet another Rolls Royce. In this episode, we'll be showing a buying guide for all of the dreamers and billionaires of this world, demonstrating the newest and the best turboprop engine planes of today. Subscribe to Automotive Territory not to miss informative videos about all sorts of motorized vehicles. Ring the bell and enjoy your flight! Piper M600 SLS Previously known under the PA46 line of aircraft as Malibu, Malibu Mirage or Malibu Meridian, Piper now refers to its upper market offerings as the M-Class. The M600 SLS model is the newest addition to the roster that exceeds industry's expectations of a single-engine pressurized cabin turboprop. This plane is on track to become the first general aviation model in the segment to be equipped with the Halo technology, which comes integrated into the Garmin G3000 avionics and allows fully autonomous landing when the system senses that the pilot is incapacitated. Besides the unparalleled safety suite, the Piper M600 SLS shines with the proven Pratt & Whitney PT6A42A engine, flat rated at 600 shaft horsepower and good for 274 knots cruising speed. At 28,000 feet, its cabin is pressurized to 8,244 and has beautiful interior as a part of the standard EXP package with selected leathers, veneer and two-tone seating scheme. Epic E1000 Epic Aircraft, originated in 2004 in Bend, Oregon, is a manufacturer of kits for the single-engine turboprop Epic LT, intended for the use by private pilots. Since 2013, the company had been focused on the certification efforts for the production version of the Kraft E1000, which were completed in November 2019 when the FAA gave it the green light. This plane has a cantilever low-wing design, carbon fiber airframe, retractable tricycle landing gear and a 6.5 psi pressurized cabin. At its heart is the 1825 horsepower Pratt & Whitney Canada PT667A turboprop, due rated to 1200 horses. The company claims over 333 knots maximum cruising speed, which makes it the fastest single-engine turboprop on the market. The safety of six occupants is aided with the Garmin G1000 and XI avionics package, while comfort comes from elegant leather seating and automatic digital cabin pressurization and climate system. Dyer TBM 940 Previously known as Cicada TBM, this high-performance single-engine turboprop was rebranded under the Dyer name in 2015. The TBM 940 is the newest and the top-range representative of the series, characterized by economical operation costs and top speeds that are comparable to light jets. Replacing the previous flagship, the 930, the new model is the first turboprop featuring a full autopilot integration system with auto throttle that adjusts the speed of the aircraft depending on the given flight profile. In addition, the $4 million worth TBM 940 boasts an innovative icing preventive system that automatically activates when redundant ice is detected. The model is offered in four or six seat configurations with eight interior packages to choose from. Its max cruise speed is rated at 330 knots, but the top range of 1,730 nautical miles can be only achieved at the long-range cruise speed of 252 knots. Pilatus PC-12 NGX Flying the sky since 1990, the Swiss PC-12 has gone over multiple upgrades in these years with the latest NGX version of the aircraft being introduced as recently as 2019. This is a single-engine turboprop aircraft that is propelled by the new 1200 shaft horsepower PT6A67P from Pratt & Whitney Canada. The model is universally hailed for offering class-leading cabin space and comfort, but its main advantages is versatility. The NGX can be optioned to accommodate from 6 to 10 people and is certified to be flown by a single pilot. In addition, it is able to take off and land on a variety of surfaces, including grass and gravel, and it only requires 
2,485 feet of runway length. This means that the PC-12 NGX can fly to 21,000 airports around the world, many of which are not accessible to other business aircraft. Cessna Denali Initially, this aircraft was known under the Textron single-engine turboprop moniker. But after the formation of a single entity, Textron Aviation, in 2014, it was continued to be developed under the Cessna brand. The Denali will be powered by the all-new General Electric Catalyst, which is the first turboprop engine to feature 3D-printed parts. The five-bladed composite propeller comes from Macaulay, and combined with the 1300 shaft horsepower strong catalyst, they ensure 285 knots of maximum cruise speed. The Cessna Denali has either six-seat executive layout or nine-seat commuter configuration, with a cabin altitude of 6,130 feet flying at 31,000 feet. It can complete flights to the distance of 1,600 nautical miles and, according to Textron, should go into service in 2020. Let's imagine you wake up a billionaire next morning. Which of these two bro props would you buy? Do not rush with the decision and check out the entire lineup. Like this episode and let's keep going! Beechcraft King Air C90 GTX Currently a brand of Textron Aviation, Beechcraft was originally founded in Wichita, Kansas some 88 years ago. It now offers a number of general aviation, utility, and business class planes, including their latest C90 GTX twin turboprop that was introduced to the market in 2014. It is the only King Air in production that is based on the original 1960s-90 series of the model. Unlike its bigger 250 and 350 siblings, this aircraft has the capacity of six passengers and two pilots, and is rated for the shorter distance trips. Its maximum range reaches 1,260 nautical miles, while the top cruising speed is 272 knots. It gets the ProPilot 21 avionics system from Collins that features 14-inch LCD touch displays and enables simplified single-pilot operations. Despite being an entry-level model in the King Air range, the C90 gets elite interior finishes and is equipped with a private bathroom. Kodiak 100 The 2019 acquisition of the American Quest aircraft made the French Dyer the seventh largest producer of business aviation planes in the world. More importantly, the company has seized control over the Quest's most iconic product, the Kodiak 100, which has recently got an upgraded version named the Series 2. First introduced in 2007, the Kodiak 100 is a 10-seat single-engine turboprop aircraft which is famous for the versatility, low cost of ownership, and minimal requirements for takeoff and landing sites. Even fully loaded, it requires under 950 feet of takeoff run to start the climb at the rate of 1,371 feet per minute. The Series 2 also received a significantly faster Garmin G1000 avionics and can be optioned with the GWX70 weather radar, single-point refueling, and aerosat carbon fiber amphibious floats. Piper M500 Within Piper's lineup, the updated version of Malibu Meridian serves as an alternative to the previously mentioned M600 SLS that allows to leave the owner's net worth intact thanks to the decreased fuel burn of just 35 gallons per hour, which makes it one of the most fuel-efficient turbo props of today. The 500 horsepower Pratt & Whitney PT6A is set to cruise at 260 knots to cover 1000 nautical miles. Besides the in-flight capabilities, this aircraft takes advantage of the impressive Garmin G1000 NXI avionics suite with the GFC 700 autopilot to ensure safe, long and short-distance missions. The M500's cabin boasts premium leather, carpet and wood metal trim in three-color variants – Wellington, Inverness and Inverness Reverse. Plus, the creature comforts abound with the convenient USB ports, lighting and seating controls for each passenger. Cessna Caravan and Grand Caravan EX The members of Caravan family are longtime workhorses of the industry that have been produced since 1982. The 2600 plus units released so far have clocked over 20 million flight hours, demonstrating a rare combination of low operating costs 
unparalleled dispatch reliability, high performance, and adaptability. The caravans are powered by the Pratt & Whitney PT6A tractor turbo prop. The 675 horsepower for the standard configuration and 867 HP 140 version that improves the rate of climb by 38% for the Grand Caravan EX. The Cessna has short 1200 through 1400 feet takeoff and landing distance and can adapt to any environment with the fixed tricycle landing gear, floats or skis. The aircraft is often used for commuter airlines, VIP transport and cargo missions with 10 to 14 occupants and useful loads of 3,305 or 3,532 pounds. The cabin is unpressurized and comes in three interior packages – Canyon, Savannah and the luxury-appointed Oasis. Beechcraft King Air 350i This is the largest model from the American aircraft manufacturer Beechcraft that measures 46 feet and 8 inches in length and can carry 11 people. The model is designed to be flown by two pilots, but is also certified for one-person operation. The 350i is marketed as business aviation aircraft, so its cabin focuses on providing the maximum comfort for the occupants. It has large windows with electric shades, while the seats get patented flex cabin system that allows to transform the area for work or entertainment. The King Air also features an onboard lavatory, a separate luggage compartment, plus a suite of ProLine Fusion avionics. In addition, the 350i exists in an ER extended range modification that is capable of carrying more fuel, increasing the range maximum from 1,806 to incredible 2,692 nautical miles. P180 Avanti Evo on sale since 2016, the Evo is the newest version of the executive P180 Avanti Chat that was launched and made extremely successful thanks to the company's cooperation with the Italian billionaire and partial Ferrari owner Piero Ferrari. Compared to the original, the model gets a more aerodynamic design, offers increased range and has higher load capacity. It is powered by the two Pratt & Whitney Canada engines, delivering 850 shaft horsepower each. Interestingly, to reduce the interior noise, the turbo props are placed mid-wing behind the cabin and are mated to the new Herzl composite 5-blade propellers mounted behind them. The Evo is also rated for the maximum speed exceeding 400 knots, making it the fastest twin turbo prop in the world. Sadly, we should mention that in 2018, Piaggio Aerospace was declared insolvent and in early 2020 it was put up for sale. Would you like to own a jet or would you prefer one of these efficient turbo props? Share with the world which one of these would be a perfect fit for your billionaire aircraft fleet. Subscribe to Automotive Territory not to miss informative videos about all sorts of motorized vehicles. Ring the notification bell and like this episode to help us grow. May the torque be with you!